Wow, look at this fog. It seems we've reached the limit of the communication range. I see. From this point onward, we'll be swallowed up in the vast darkness of space. Then this is our final farewell. Are you sure you don't want Lloyd to know? There's no need. Lloyd and I said our goodbyes before I left there. My place is in the past. I'm counting on you to look after the World Tree. Of course. Um... I thought you set up a barrier. He's the Summon Spirit that I told you about. He is Ratatosk, the Summon Spirit we met back then. That's probably why the barrier didn't affect him. I'm sorry. It looks like I'm interrupting. No, we are the ones who should apologize. It was we who betrayed your trust. Lord Ratatosk's memory of your past meeting is currently sealed. Ah, a Centurion. It's been quite a while. The world has changed a great deal while we were asleep. Indeed it has. But Lloyd and his friends seem to have straightened out all the problems we left behind. Who are you? I am Kratos Arion. I travel with Daris Carlon into the depths. Kratos is an old companion of mine. I've kept him informed of what's transpired on this world since he left. And in turn, he's done the same for me regarding our companions who've moved to Daris Carlon. Please do not mention anything about him to Lloyd or the others. In any case, this is the last contact he has with this world. Yes. I hear you and Lloyd are traveling together. Yes, he's helped me a lot. Please look after Lloyd and all of his friends. Yes. We're about to lose our communication link. I'm afraid I must say goodbye. Farewell, you and Carfe, my friend. Farewell, Kratos Arion, my friend. Um, what's Daris Carlon? It's the name of a world very far away from ours. They say it is the native land of the Summon Spirits and Elves. Right now, they're roaming the universe, looking for somewhere they can live in peace. So Kratos is on Daris Carlon? Yes. I'm not sure I totally understand, but I hope they find a place to live in peace. I do as well. <laughs>